It's the sort of news many Cape Townians were dreading. The worsening drought has led to even more order restrictions. And now only 50 litres of water is allowed per person per day. That's down from 87 litres per day. And it's being implemented after some residents all but ignored pleas to decrease their use. And now the city plans to get tough. Among new measures to be introduced are heavy fines for errant residents. As the city prioritises stability of the economy going forward. Economic centres um, would as far as possible not be as impacted on precisely because the economy is necessary to be maintained and we need to create jobs. Um, but obviously we are waiting those, those full details. It's also working on a plan to introduce water stations throughout the city where people can collect their water allocations come day zero. One side of economic relief was the tourism sector, which seemed to be flourishing even amidst the drought. So far, we actually saw a really excellent December peak season. Um, according to airports company South Africa, Cape Town International Airport um, saw a 11.5% increase year in year of international arrivals. That means we actually saw growth in tourists arriving into Cape Town. There is, however, general consensus among stakeholders that the worst is now unavoidable, and that has increased the anxiety amongst Cape Townians. The revised water allocation is going to be tough to stick to, and here on the streets is already deep concern. Day zero is, is imminent. It's going to happen, and we have to just like start to think about that, start to realize that we're going to have to start doing something. I mean, So we're concerned about it because we have children, we have a household to hold, we've got washing to do, etc. So to us, the 15 litre won't be enough. What we're going to do about it, I don't know, because it's not in our hands. The community is very scared, you know, having no water, because now the situation is going to be bad. People are going to be worried now, because water, you know, is a need here in South Africa, you know. For now, Day Zero is projected for the 21st of April this year, when the taps run dry, and the situation becomes what may be the worst natural disaster the mother city has ever seen. Davis Andrews, CGTN Cape Town.